Hey there, this is Darren. Hollywood celebrities. And just celebrities. Do you ever wonder, like, or maybe even catch yourself saying, oh man, I'm so jealous. They have it so easy, it must be nice. Well, sometimes when I'm teaching other speakers, they see I have 3.3 million views and 15,000 subscribers and think, wow, that's cool. But what are you jealous of? So I never really thought about this before until I, until I started seeing how people uh, kind of reacted to me after I had won the world championship. And I met a lot of people around the world who are jealous of the trophy or being a CSP, which is a huge designation. And I met a lot of people around the world who are jealous of the trophy. And, but what I've never met people jealous of, these are like all the videotapes of speeches I've given and I've gone back and studied. Hey, Palmo. You know, I've never had anyone jealous of the work that took me to get there. You know, but I, I'm guilty of this too. I think about it and... Yeah, I see people like Mike Rayburn on stage and playing his guitar and just amazing. And I'm like, oh, that would be so cool to be that talented. Well, Mike Rayburn practices two hours a day and he has been for decades. You know, when I studied the other world champions, uh, I watched 10 years of contest videos. It's 90 world-class speeches and I studied the winners over and over again. And sometimes when we see celebrities and stuff, we think, you know, yeah, it must be nice. They get a cushy job, but we don't know how many auditions they went, how many people told them they were stupid, how many people told them they were idiots. We don't know that. So I'm trying to catch myself being judgmental and thinking, we got to ask ourselves what brought them what it was they wanted. So, look, I feel very fortunate that I get to do what I love to do for a living. That's my closet here. Um, I guess it's just you and me, Palmo. But when getting ready to pack to go back for Thanksgiving, when I look at my YouTube channel, like, yeah, it's cool I did 3.3 million views. But it was like 10 years ago that I started putting up one video a day. And no one was jealous of the things I had to sacrifice, the things I had to not do because I was making YouTube videos. And I had some horrible videos. I could show you horrible videos, bad lighting, it's ridiculous. However, I learned through that process. That's why I love this 90 day challenge because I'm growing and it's cool other people are jumping in too and they're growing too. Look, I'm really not saying this to brag. I'm just trying to use it as an example of we need to catch ourselves, myself included, to not be jealous of Mike Rayburn, but be jealous of the practice that he puts in every single day to be a master like he is. So, what are you jealous of? Don't be jealous of the trophy. Don't be jealous of the master on stage. Be jealous of the work ethic that brought them there. Palmo, we probably have to be more thankful than we have to be jealous of. Amen. Yep. I have to be thankful that I did all that work, not really knowing if it would ever pay off. One of my favorite lines in Miracle, the movie, about the 1984 hockey team is when the coach says, you know, <clears throat> there's nothing like guys working their butt off, uh, chasing an unknown, not knowing. And one of my favorite quotes by Rudy Rudiger is, people aren't afraid of hard work, they're afraid of hard work not paying off. So, it's my lesson for today. See you tomorrow. Take care, Palmo.